A fundraiser was held in Patchogue today on behalf of the Gabby Petito Foundation. Petito's family launched the foundation to support families with missing loved ones. The event included live music, a silent auction, and a raffle. Eyewitness News reporter Lucy Yang has more on today's event and the ongoing investigation. She is live on the Upper West Side. Lucy. Well, Sandra, slain Long Island native Gabby Petito is back in the news tonight. This time, her family hoping to turn their personal tragedy into a positive for others. That's the mission statement for the Gabby Petito Foundation, which hosted its first fundraiser in Patchogue, Long Island today. It started at 1, and we understand is still going on at this hour. There was music, raffles, food, donations. This after a watershed of tears following the young woman's tragic ending. What began as a cross-country tour with her boyfriend to be documented on social media, turned into a missing persons case, which ended with the discovery of her strangled body out west in Wyoming. Today, those who loved the 22-year-old and those who just want to help came out to give. We're here to raise some money and have some good music, some food, and a good time in her memory, because we believe that's what she would wanted us to do. Meanwhile, the search continues for Brian Laundrie, her boyfriend and now person of interest. He returned to his parents' home in Florida without her and without answering any questions.